Lisa, thanks. The Pennsylvania Treasury has $4.5 billion in unclaimed property, but not all the funds are forgotten personal items. Our Pennsylvania Capital Correspondent Kara Jeffers has the story on an unusual donation from the state. At most charity donation events, organizations can expect a giant cardboard check. Today, though, three nonprofits walked away with tinier but equally valuable prizes. So I have 53 gift cards worth more than $21,000 that were reported to Treasury by the Abington Township Police Department in Montgomery County and the West Manchester Township Police Department in New York County. In two separate cases, police came across gift cards most likely bought with credit card fraud. Both departments did great work and arrests were made, but they never had enough information to identify anyone the gift card should be returned to. And with no way of finding a rightful owner, we're able to turn this into a great opportunity to make a big difference here today. The Ronald McDonald House, Pennsylvania Special Olympics, and Veterans Multi-Service Centers each received around $7,200 respectively. These gift cards allow us to purchase what we need when we need it for our programs and for our families. Our athletes, it's, there's so many, so much complexity to what we do, and it's the statewide organization of 15,000 athletes, and it's free of charge. So you can imagine sort of the ancillary costs that come about with it, if it's sports equipment, if it's, you know, a travel expense. Treasurer Garrity said the organizations were picked to represent the Treasury Department's other programs like PA ABLE and PA 529 savings accounts. In Harrisburg, I'm Kara Jeffers, Erie News Now. And Kara says if you want to check to see if you have any unclaimed property, well, you can head online and do that. And because of a new law passed this summer, Pennsylvanians with $500 or less in unclaimed property will have it automatically returned. Great deal. Still to come this evening.